Hey, welcome back guys. This is episode 6. Sorry we were missing for about 2 weeks. We were celebrating New Year's and Christmas so we didn't have time to shoot. So one of my biggest wish for 2021 is that we can start traveling again. And I was thinking where would be the first place I would visit? I haven't been to Korea. So I'm thinking, hey, can I create a Korean themed burger today? Uh, just as an inspiration. So when we can travel, I will start making my way there. It's gonna be a kimchi, fried prawn, and beef burger. So you will need some peeled prawns and our friends at Top Cash have those, 11 ringgit only. You need a frying flour and then our beef patty. Today I'll be using the jalapeno cheddar beef and also some pickles. And you need an egg to batter the prawn with. Next, you will need some kimchi of course and we're gonna use a gojujang ketchup. So we're gonna combine gojujang sauce with Heinz ketchup. And for the second sauce, we're gonna need some lime, mayo, honey and sesame oil. So for the first sauce, cut the lime and then we're gonna mix the mayo, honey and sesame together. So once you've squeezed the lime, remove the seeds and then just a little bit of honey just for the sweetness. Mayo and just a dash of sesame oil. Alright, once they're evenly mixed, you can set them aside. So the first sauce is done. Really, really yummy. Now we're going to do the second sauce. Make sure you get a gochujang sauce that you like. You can get it at any supermarket. Today we have some from Otafuku. Alright, we're going to do a one-to-one -one ratio. Again, I'm going to eyeball this. We're going to mix it together evenly. Just a quick whisk. And you can set it aside. Now that you have prawns in the ice water, crack one egg and then whisk it. This is just to prepare it for the egg batter. So after you're done whisking your egg, add a little bit of salt and pepper to give it that little bit of a flavor. Next, grab your prawns, shake off the excess water and soak them in there. Make sure they're well coated and then we're going to coat them in the flour. Once you're finished braiding your prawns, just set them aside and then we'll come back to frying them later. They'll be the last thing that we do. Alright, now we have the prawns ready, we have the two sauces ready as well. We're gonna grill some kimchi. Now, I love kimchi, but I think it is better when you grill it. Now, for those that love kimchi, I'm sorry I have to do this. Personally, I love my kimchi charred. Alright, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put a little bit of butter on here and put some cold kimchi on until it's charred. You can get your kimchi from anywhere, you can make it yourself. I got a store-bought one today and I'm gonna grill that. So we're gonna use a little bit of butter just to heat up the pan and we're gonna put our kimchi on. Low and slow and it should get the color that you want. You don't want to burn it, but you want to char it. Make sure everything is on the pan and you get as much surface contact as possible so you can char it. So for the jalapeno patty, just grill it for about two minutes and then you flip it onto the other side and grill it until it's charred on the other side as well. It's about an estimated two minutes as well. Alright, once you flip it, make sure you put the cheese on and let it melt naturally over it. To melt the cheese faster, just add a little bit of water, cover it and let it steam for about 20-30 seconds. Alright, once the patty is ready, set it aside. Don't let the fat go to waste, use it to toast your bun. Use the bun to absorb all the fat so the flavour is kept within the burger and just let it toast. Your prawns have been sitting out for a while. Put on the second coat. So the prawns cook really quickly. So do pick them up the moment they are nice and crispy. Right, now the kimchi has been cooking here on its own for a while now and they're a little bit dried up. But that's okay. If you look here closely, it's a little bit charred. And that's the beauty of it. The flavour is very intensified. Now what I would do now, just add a little bit of water and you want to deglaze. You want to remove all that char up and let the kimchi soak it up. And also to rehydrate the kimchi again. If you are here, you can smell the amazing smell that it's creating. It's amazing. Alright, now we have all our ingredients ready to make our Korean burger. We have our two sauces, pickles, we have the burger ready, the prawns, and some chaat kimchi. Alright, let's get assembling. We're gonna get the bottom bun ready. Look at how nicely it's toasted, nice and crunchy. Next, we're gonna put the gojujang ketchup. I'm gonna put it at the bottom because I want that first bite to be sour and spicy at the same time. Next, we're gonna put a patty on there. Next, we're going to use the burger lap pickles. I love the burger lap pickle because it is marinated in vinegar, chili patty, sugar, and it's, it's just really, really flavorful and it's crunchy as well. After this, I'm going to put some chaat kimchi on top. I'm going to be really generous with this because this is going to be the main star of the show. Look at that. 
Next, I'm gonna put just a little bit of mayo just to hold them together. And then the prawns. Now, the prawns, you can put as much as you want. One of it is gonna go into my mouth first. <laughs> so good. Next, we're gonna stack it up. We're gonna put on our honey sesame lime aioli. All right, I'm gonna drizzle this bad boy over this. Next, we're gonna get a top bun, which is nicely toasted. Add on a little bit more of the gochujang ketchup. Ta-da! Wow, look at this burger. It's got so many layers. It's got the charred kimchi, it's got the pickles, it's got the fried prawns. I can't wait to dig into this. All right, we're gonna cut it in half. I'm gonna take a bite and see what it tastes like. All right, let's grab a bite. Ugh. Mm. <laughs> this should be on the menu. <laughs> the jalapeno beef patty has such a nice smokiness to it. I don't know, maybe that's coming from the chart kimchi. The prawn is crunchy, it's juicy. Holy sh! <laughs> <laughs> and then the sauce, that, that honey sesame lime aioli. That's amazing. I'm gonna take another bite. Mm. Oh, sh! Alright guys, that's the end of episode 6. I wish you can try this burger. I'm gonna take my time and finish this on the side. Um, like and subscribe, whatever else that they say usually. And check out our previous episodes. Yeah, get out of my way. I, I need to eat this burger. I need to spend some private time with this burger. Oh, come to daddy. <laughs>